you guys can see in today's amazing adventure, what we're going to be doing is seeing if we can put an end to these bad, terrible characters that have come from a pretty crazy place. And in today's video, that is going to be, of course, the Pibby Dimension, if you guys didn't know. So with that being said, let us go into today's amazing adventure. So as you guys can see, we are on this amazing world. And in today's video, what essentially what we're going to be getting away from is the Pibby virus. Now, if you guys don't know what the virus is, we are going to basically show you, okay? Because this virus is absolutely incredible. It's absolutely scary. And multiple characters and multiple people have been infected. So our job right now is to get rid of this virus and make sure that whatever is happening here doesn't happen again. So what we're trying to do is trying to trap every single character that is part of the Pibby virus. And that way, we can get rid of these guys. As you guys can see, Pibby is over there, okay? And so far, that means that she's going to be joining us on this adventure. So let's go have a chat with her to see exactly what she's up to. Because if we can have a chat with her, we can better understand exactly what's going on with this crazy Minecraft world. So uh, let's go have a chat with her. Okay, so Pibby, what is up? I understand that you're here. I understand that you need to tell me some stuff. What exactly is going on? Because we are about to embark on an adventure. I can help you on your journey. Thank you. That's exactly what I need. I need help on my journey. That's a, that 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 would be the best thing. So um, yeah, let's uh, go ahead and see what else we can do. Um, I'll help you a lot. Okay, so you've given me armor, which is good. Armor is exactly what I need. I wouldn't need anything else. Um, what else would I need, actually? Yeah, I would need um, some golden apples. But of course, I'm going to use that to bribe her to work for me, which is amazing. Um, what else is there? Um, we have some okay so the virus of course as you guys can see starts here in this world which is of course not good but what's interesting is that it follows a kind of path so i guess we can kind of see exactly what's going on um over here which is pretty cool if you ask me so we can actually follow this all the way if it doesn't get too far we can actually follow this to all the pibby characters and stop them from spawning in ever again because they are actually mob spawners so that's actually going to be exactly how we managed to save that. So that is going to be pretty cool on my end. So what we need to do now is see if we can find the first Pibby spawner. Now, there's a villager over there. He doesn't look like he's up to nothing. So what we're going to do is I'm going to um, see if I can figure out exactly what he's up to. Um, and maybe have a chat with this villager because this villager seems pretty cool. So I'm going to have a chat with this villager if possible. Um, have a conversation with him. And hopefully he's up to... Uh... So yeah, do not go into the forest. No one has ever made it out. Really? That's pretty scary. No one has ever made it out of the forest? I didn't know that. I would have thought that someone has made it out. That's a pretty scary thought, actually. Um, so yeah, he's advising us not to go into the forest. But as you guys know, we're adventurers, okay? And of course, that means we're not going to listen to this guy. We're going to make sure that we go into the forest because, you know, I feel that the forest is... Okay, that skeleton is scaring me. I don't want to go into the forest now, but I'm going to anyways, just because I feel that, you know, we might as well. So let's try it. Let's try going into the forest if possible guys um even though it's against our best wishes and we probably are going to get into a bit of a situation here let's just go into the forest just for the sake of it you guys can see there's a skeleton there that doesn't look too good but at the end of the day um i'm gonna try and see if this is um i don't know possible because wow there's another skeleton that's also trapped there what the okay this is crazy there's so much stuff going on right now this is crazy i'm gonna make sure that um whatever is done isn't exactly um crazy so i gotta make sure that i am extremely safe right now that's one thing i'm gonna be doing okay so guys keep your eyes peeled because there are skeletons dead there is the pibby virus here there is a whole load of stuff going on that i gotta make sure that i am gonna be 100 percent okay you guys can see right now i don't know where this creature came out of but there is a pibby virus creature that just literally came out of nowhere so i gotta make sure that i go ahead and destroy this creature as quick as possible because this is absolutely insane guys i don't know where this creature's come from but this creature has just absolutely destroyed me i don't know where it's come from but um yeah we gotta we gotta we gotta we gotta get this done as quick as possible i don't know what this creature is doing but this creature is super duper strong guys i don't think i'm ever gonna be able to get away from this creature but uh yeah he is super 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 strong are these are these zombies just part of the natural world i'm guessing they're part of the world because of the um because of the virus so i'm guessing that's why they're here so we got to be super careful to make sure that these guys don't come back because if they do boy oh boy it is gonna be super duper scary guys all right so those zombies have now been defeated and it looks like we've managed to destroy this foothold so what we need to do is continue on 
this journey and see if there are different areas where we can continue to find other characters. So there are three other characters in this world that we're going to need to find. We're going to need to find Jake and we're going to need to find Finn. And I think we're going to need to find Sonic too. So let's carry on this trail and see what it is that we can find. Because if we do manage to find something else, um, it's going to be pretty useful for us. So we've got to be super careful here not to have something like that destroy us. Um, okay, and these, these Sonic ones, as you guys can see, are pretty pretty strong if you ask me okay so this sonic i've been fighting him for like five hours now and he shows no signs of being destroyed okay wow finally as soon as i say that he literally just dies that, that, that's amazing i'm so glad finally managed to get him down um but let's go ahead and see what we can do here because this is definitely pretty insane i'm not gonna lie to you guys we gotta be super careful to make sure that we don't die here I'm not gonna lie um all right there's like even more sonics just coming out of the woodworks i don't even know where these sonics came from just came literally from nowhere so um yeah i gotta be super duper careful to not die here um but i think my golden apples are really good i think i think we're doing a pretty decent job um i gotta be honest these sonics are getting pretty crazy if these sonics continue whoa okay wow pibby actually helped me there i was gonna say if these sonics continue to get pretty easy i would call for reinforcements and i would use myself as a battering ram and i would get the biggest mods as you guys know grenade launchers rocket launchers and i would use that to destroy all of these mods so uh yeah if they if this happens again that's exactly what i will be doing um if that thing happens again it looks like we've oh no oh no oh no this is not good this is not good at all this is not good at all you guys can see that we are now fighting what is his name jake finn i honestly don't know which one it is i think it's finn the human and no no it's jake jake is a boy's name finn is a dog's name this is incredible okay so let's get out of here while we still can um oh my god okay so oh whoa okay so it looks like what we have here guys is a spawner oh my god okay how many characters are there this is incredible i did not even see that creature there so it looks like what we have there is a spawner I honestly didn't even know that there was a spawner there, but that is pretty incredible if you ask me. So let's take this moment to try and fight off these mobs as quickly as possible, because if we don't, we're going to be in some serious trouble. So I've been eating these golden apples and fighting these zombies for quite some time, and this is super duper difficult, if I'm being honest to you guys. This is pretty intense. As you guys can see, these guys keep spawning. So I realized that the PV virus essentially has some kind of mob spawners. So what we have to do is we have to destroy these mob spawners and then we can destroy the entire virus. That's the only way for that stuff to get done. So yeah, it's pretty cool if you ask me. So far in this village or in this jungle, we've definitely seen quite a bit of danger. I think we've done a pretty good job of getting past it but we must now see what that is what is that i honestly have no idea what that is like i honestly have no idea like i'm very confused as to what i'm looking at right there so uh yeah let's go ahead and be careful um and see if we can find out exactly what that is i don't know exactly what that is but i'm kind of concerned a little bit um so yeah let's go ahead and use this elytra to figure out what's up here is it some flying one if there's some flying pibby that's going to be pretty insane if you ask me um that it'll be pretty cool but it'll also be pretty insane if i'm being honest so um yeah let's go over here um i don't know what this is why are we going through these is this some kind of checkpoint maze or something i have no idea but we're going to do this anyways and once we go through this we're going to see if we can defeat the other creatures too um because that would be pretty useful so let's go ahead and see what happens there i've managed to get my golden apple here as you guys can see so far everything looks good we are doing absolutely well and so far, the majority of these Pibby characters have been destroyed and have been trapped. So, so far, things are going exceedingly well. I'm excited. I'm excited for this. I'm very, very excited. Things have gone as well as they can go. But you guys can see that currently we're looking at a group of creepers, okay? And those are some very bad Pibby creepers. So, uh, they are pretty dangerous if you ask me so what we want to do is get to destroying the spawner as quickly as possible uh there we go there we go there we go there we go if we can destroy that spawner as quick as possible that is going to be the best thing that we can do for now um i know it's pretty hard to do but that's what i am trying to do so um if we can destroy the spawner that would be pretty amazing um it's pretty difficult if i'm being honest okay so as you guys can see we managed to defeat the creeper pibbies um it looks like there's going to be a bunch more pibbies that we do need to defeat i'm not sure how many more but it looks like we might be nearing the end of this because we do have a bunch of other creatures as you guys can see so it looks like we managed to defeat the creeper pibby the zombie one um i don't know what the other one is going to be called but um i'm ready for it i'm here i'm ready I'm, I'm i'm excited to see exactly what we got going on so let's go ahead and see if we can do this guys because i am 100 ready for whatever we've got going on here so uh these herobrine ones i didn't think they would be that strong 
but these guys are super strong. I would think these are the strongest out of all the pibbies. So um, be super careful when fighting these ones, guys. Okay, so I think we've managed to defeat the majority of these pibbies. I'm not exactly sure if we have, but I think the majority of these pibbies are actually gone. So I think now it's a situation where we are currently looking to see if we can somehow destroy this world. I don't know if that's going to even be possible, but I'm going to go ahead and see if I can do this, guys, because it's not easy to do this by yourself. But you guys know me. I'm someone who's pretty different when it comes to this kind of stuff. So, uh, yeah, let's follow the gold and see where it leads us. Because I don't know where the gold is going to lead us to. But I'm pretty excited to see where we can go with this. Okay, so, as you guys can see, what I'm doing here is I'm trapping these creatures. Because uh, these guys are pretty intense. So, what I'm trying to do now is I'm trying to trap these as quick as possible. So, uh, you guys can see that I'm trying to trap these guys with all this stone. I'm not even sure if this is going to work. But... If it does work, I will go down in history as the man who saved the universe from the Pibi virus. So yeah, definitely pretty intense if you ask me. 